A number of American bald eagles can be seen. Um, it's just beautiful. What an amazing sight. And you can actually make some reservations to go see this historic bird. We'll tell you how when we come back. TGIC. I recently had the opportunity to head to the Shep Hog Dam in Southbury to take a look at something you normally don't see here in America, in Connecticut, excuse me. The American bald eagle. And we didn't just see just one, Kara. We saw several of the birds in the wild. And you can too. Take a look. In 2001, while a volunteer at the Shep Hog Dam's wildlife observation site in Southbury, Lucy Walker experienced something wonderful. I was up in the parking lot and a bald eagle flew right over my head. And from that moment on, I was hooked. <laughs> so I've been here every year since. Lucy is now the wildlife guide here where American bald eagles come to feed each season. We are in Southbury, Connecticut at the Chapal Dam okay. on the Housatonic River. Behind us in this river valley, there's some really hidden gems that are not so quite visible to the eye. One of the main attractions here is the bald eagle. Bald eagle is native to North America, and this is what we call a winter feeding area for migrating bald eagles. So we are lucky in the state of Connecticut that we get migratory bald eagles that come into the state during the winter looking for open water to fish because fish is their primary diet. Um, and the dam provides that for them because what happens is the dam prevents the water from freezing and there's almost a guarantee that there's always open water and fish here for them. And almost a guarantee that if you come during the 29th season of the facility being open to the public, you too will see the eagles. You see them in the tree there? Those two small dots, those are American bald eagles. This past weekend, yeah. we had our high count of 16 birds we had. On one, in one day? In one day, in one morning. That's a lot of eagles. We had six birds in one tree. Six birds in one tree. In one tree. More about our national symbol. The bald eagle is um, about three feet tall and about a seven and a half foot wingspan. It's pretty wide. It's pretty wide, it's pretty big. It's a pretty big bird the top of the food chain. The bald eagle with the white head and the white tail is what we have visible behind me in some of the trees, but we also have what we call immature bald eagles. They're the same size as an adult bald eagle, but they are brown and white because it takes them five years to get the white head and white tail. Here's two immatures flying and playing together in the sky. Now, with our cameras, we can see the eagles, but for a better view, look through these spotting scopes that they will have available. And right now, I'm looking at a bald American eagle. Isn't that beautiful? They were once endangered um, on the federal list, and they have been removed from uh, the federal endangered species list. But they're still uh, protected in other ways, and they still remain on the state endangered species list. The numbers are growing. We do have a breeding population here in Connecticut. Um, 1992 was the first breeding pair that was discovered since the 1950s, since the decline of the bald eagle. And from 1992, we now have 35 breeding pairs in Connecticut. Whether or not these birds feeding at the dam are residents from Connecticut or just here for a visit is unknown. But what is known is how exciting it is to see the symbol of the United States of America. Yeah. Oh, I'm, every day it's very exciting for me. The great part is also seeing people like you that have never seen that. Yeah. And for them to see that for the first time, it's, it's, it's exciting. It's exciting. We were just learning through your story and also through our motocross, Nick Dunn, that they're not endangered anymore federally. It's federally. just in Connecticut. Just in Connecticut, they are still a protected species. So, and over the course of the 28 years, they average about seven eagles a day, which is just great. So if you go, uh, you're almost guaranteed like 99% chance that you're going to see a bald eagle. Call this number, 800-368-8954, 800-368-8954. And reservations can be made Tuesday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Just gorgeous country out there. Absolutely. Beautiful.